We good? We recording? Oh my god! A crazy ex-girlfriend gets stuck in a chimney? Forget breaking hearts, that's breaking and entering. Yo guys, what's up? Dave Waffle here and welcome to I.O. <laughs> Why did I become a freaking cartoon character? Okay, so let's be real. Have you guys ever done some things that you kind of regret because you were a little crazy over an ex? Oh man, I've been there. The stories, I feel so embarrassed. Okay, so we're going to South California for this story. A story where an unidentified woman got stuck in a chimney. Now this woman is not being named, but she's 35 years old and apparently was the ex-girlfriend of the homeowner named Tony Hernandez. So the story goes to the the woman went up to the front of the house, tried to get in by, you know, opening the door, realizing it was locked. So she went up on the roof, she took all of her clothes off, and decided to shove herself down that chimney. Now, if this was a Christmas Eve story, this would be awesome, but it wasn't. But I want to know, if you guys think breaking and entering down a chimney is a bad idea, hit that like button. Better yet, if you think breaking and entering is a bad idea, period, hit that like button. However, it was around 5 o'clock in the morning when Tony could hear the gentle sound of some sweet pea. And by sweet pea, I mean this woman screaming for help saying that she's stuck in the chimney. No, it wasn't sugar plums dancing through his head, it was his ex-girlfriend. So Tony grabbed an extension cord and actually tried to help her get out, but that failed miserably, so he ended up calling, you know, the fire department. The roof is on fire, we don't need no water. So 23 firefighters showed up for this woman, which took them two hours to get her out of the chimney. God, people never learn. But the woman was taken to a hospital for her injuries, and on top of that, she's banned from seeing her children. Why? Because nobody wants something that crazy around y'all kids. So what are your thoughts on this woman? Do you think maybe she should do some jail time? Yeah, I'm leaving at that. The editors are going to deal with that bad communication. So thanks for watching, guys. I'm Dave Wapple, and as I always say, keep it real, keep it classy, keep it on the flip side, out there, in the real world. Oh, yeah. And uh, don't break and enter unless it's in Disney World or Wonderland or any theme park. Ride in the coasters all day long.